Hello everyone, Jonas here and today we're going to demystify the DNS codes myth Is it really helpful to speed up the internet connection on your PlayStation 4 or PlayStation 5? Usually I do a tutorial showing you how to do it But this time we're going to do a bit of tests uh, It's like a different kind of videos And we're gonna use the PS4 as an example you can also use the PS5 and keep in mind that the PS5 can reach speeds that are higher than the PS4 due to the latest hardware. These tests will be done on a stable fiber optic internet connection in France. If you are using a very unstable internet connection and it's not fiber optic, the results may vary a lot or it might not make a difference at all, but as a reference I'm using a stable fiber optic internet connection. First of all, we're going to do a quick test by being connected via Wi-Fi. And um, for the rest of the video, I'm going to be connected via an Ethernet cable because it always helps you to get a stable ping and a faster internet connection. As you can see, connected on Wi-Fi, the router is like 2 meters away from the PlayStation. It's very close, so you have a full signal strength. And as you can see, these are the results I get. Now what we need to do is to go and set up internet connection but use a LAN cable this time and I'm going to keep the settings on easy and uh, just for a quick basic test and uh, we're gonna check the internet connection right now Tag 2 as you can see the speeds improved dramatically this is no difference this is not Photoshop this is not uh, fake this is basically what happens when you connect your uh, PlayStation via an Ethernet instead of a router. And just keep in mind, the download speed is 5 times faster and the upload speed is 2 times faster. Now we're gonna go ahead and start to try some DNS codes right now and use custom internet connection. Of course, I will not set up a custom IP address and open ports for the moment because I do not target the net type, but I'm going to use custom DNS settings. The first one we're gonna use, as you can see on the table or the chart, is Google's public DNS, which have for primary 8.8.8.8 and secondary 8.8.4.4. And then we're gonna do uh, automatic MTU, do not use, and we're gonna test the internet connection again to see if it really makes a difference. So, as you can see, the download speed is uh, the went from 250 to 170 but the upload speed went up to 140 for example megabit per second now this might also be due to the fact that the even the fiber optic is not that stable so i'm gonna go ahead and run another test a second time just to see like for example right now we get a 276 and a 130 so it actually improved the download speed on the second test and improved the upload speed as well and we're gonna test again just to make sure a third time that the DNS codes did actually help us and as you can see we're getting a more uh, like a faster upload speed and the same amount of download speed now this might also be due to the internet that is quite unstable even for fiber optic and it might not make a difference at all but we're gonna keep going for the video Sometimes the DNS settings actually do solve other issues like connection problems But right now we're trying to see if they help improve the speed Second one we're gonna try is the Cloudflare primary DNS and the secondary 1.1.1.1 and to automatic do not use and we're gonna test internet connection again just to see if this makes any difference as you can see, we're back on slower upload speed and slower download speed. Now keep in mind, I'm in France and the DNS servers actually depend on your location in the world whether it helps you get a faster or a slower internet connection. So we're gonna test another time just to make sure that as well, it was not a faulty test. As you can see, 270 for download, but only seven for upload. We're gonna do one last test. Like these results may seem weird, but like, um, we just make sure that, as you can see, we're back on 237 and 56. So, using Cloudflare's public DNS is like no DNS. We get a slower upload speed. So, so far, Google's DNS helped us improve our upload speed and a bit a download speed sometimes. 
we're gonna go ahead and try another DNS code. Now I'm not gonna try all of them because it will make a video that is way too long, but we're gonna try to do like at least five. So DNS advantage, 156.154.70.1 for primary and 156.154.70.2 point one this is the dns advantage and we're gonna do as you can see we're doing three tests for dns to make sure that uh, it's not a faulty test so as you can see this one actually crushed my download speed and upload speed but it might be a faulty one maybe from doing too many tests so we're gonna try again to make sure that this dns did not actually ruin my connection as you can see, this DNS doesn't seem to be a good one for us because it reduced our download speed like from 250 to 80 and then it reduced our upload speed that we had with Google from 130 to 5. So uh, yeah, we're gonna try another code right now. This one is no good for us. We're gonna go ahead and try another DNS which is this time the Open DNS Home primary will be. 208.67.220.220 Second day will be 208.67.222.222 And then we're gonna get next, MTU, do not use, and test internet settings For the open DNS home we get a stable download speed that's around 200, which is okay. Like 200, 250, 190, I think it's pretty much due to the internet and not the DNS code. But right here, our upload speed improved back to 130. Almost as good as we had it with Google. So, this is actually a good DNS. We're gonna do two more tests just to make sure that the speed actually reached this value. And always make sure it's an Ethernet cable, it's not connected to Wi-Fi. So connection speed download 226, upload 135. This one seems to be good. It gives us a stable upload of 130 megabit per, megabit per second and the download varies from 220 to 250 to 200. So it's kind of a good one, but not the best one. So far, the best DNS is Google's. Now we're going to go ahead and do one more test. And uh, there we go. Maybe there will be more DNS that I didn't try and that were actually good, but uh, maybe I'll do a part two because this video is already too long. We're gonna try finally, let us say, um, the safe DNS. So it's 195.46.39.39 and the secondary 195.46.39.39. Point forty, and I forgot to mention that changing the DNS code on your system does not bring you any problem, no uh, privacy issues, and it doesn't matter for your IP address or anything. So don't be scared about that. This one gives us a fast download speed of two forty, but a slower upload speed of fifty six megabit per second. We're gonna try to do one more test just to make sure that it's the same results. We're getting around a good download speed, but the upload speed is not the best. So on the five DNS codes that I tested, Google, Cloudflare, DNS Advantage, OpenDNS, and Safe DNS, I can clearly say that we have a winner, which is Google's public DNS. But at the same time, we do have the DNS, uh, the open DNS that was actually quite good and uh, almost as fast as the Google's or uh, Google's public and uh, primary and secondary DNS. So we're gonna set back the Google's DNS and we're gonna test the internet connection again. And this is the one that I'll be using that I use while gaming because it gives you the fastest speed around 250, which is quite good and the highest upload speed of 136. So this has been it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'm gonna leave you with a message from today's sponsor iTop VPN is not only a fast, free, and secure VPN for your browser, but also the sponsor of today's video. iTop VPN allows you a private access to the internet and hides your IP and encrypts your network data as well. It also allows you to get free access to any content that has been geo-restricted around the world 
but also enhances your privacy and allows you to use Adblock if you wish to do so. Adblock VPN is available for Windows, Mac, Android, and iOS, and right now for 80% off and just over $2 a month, you can take advantage of the full year plan.